this video tutorial i will cover how to inject array which is having a dependent object using a spring dependency injection by setter method here i have defined the class fruit it has two properties name and color and here i have defined setter and getter methods for these two properties and here i have overridden two string method here i have defined the class fruit shop it has two properties shop name and fruit array fruit array accept fruit object and fruit object is the dependent object and here i have defined getter and setter methods for these two properties and it has display fruit shop info method this is the spring configuration file here we have mentioned fruit one object fruit two object and fruit shop object should be created by spring container using spring dependency injection by setter method property element invokes the setter method fruit one object name will be set as apple and color will be set as red by calling setter methods of name and color by spring container fruit two object name will be set as grapes and color will be set as violet by calling setter methods of name and color by spring container fruit shop object property name is shop name and value is fruit mart so set shop name method will be called by spring container and shop name will be set as fruit mart and property name is fruit array so set fruit array method will be called by spring container and fruit array will be set as fruit one object and fruit two object fruit one object is this one and fruit two object is this one array element is used to define the array what object to instantiate what object to configure and how to configure this information will be there in spring configuration file in this example we have specified fruit one object fruit two object and fruit shop object should be created by spring container using a spring dependency injection by setter method spring container read this spring configuration file and creates a fruit shop object and configure the fruit shop object and manage the complete life cycle of fruit shop object here i have defined a class app here i have created application context object by reading a spring configuration file using a get bean method of application context object i am getting a fruit shop object from a spring container and displaying the fruit shop information here you can see the output and fruit shop object shop name is set as fruit mart and fruit array contains fruit one object and fruit two object both are dependent objects.